It's Sunday morning, 11 o'clock, or actually 11.15. Running late as usual, uh, headed out to John's Incredible Pizza. We're gonna have uh, Logan's birthday party, so this should be fun. We're at John's Incredible Pizza Company, and we're coming in our own special party entrance. And there's Milana, I see Milana. Okay, go in, Logan. Happy it's his birthday. How old are you turning today, Logan? Nine. Nine. Are you in third grade? Happy birthday, it's your day. Light the candles, make a wish. All your friends are here to say. Happy birthday, it's your day. Happy birthday, it's your day. That was a good time. A little pricey, but uh, I highly recommend doing it at least once. 
now it's time to go home and sit there in a coma because I ate way, way too much. It is 9.20, Sunday, July 12th. Um, we had Logan's birthday party today at uh, John's Incredible Pizza, and it was a big success. Um, we invited 32 people. We had four people that showed up there yesterday, so they couldn't make it today. Um, one of my sisters uh, sent her three kids along with my parents, and then they didn't come, so which was no big deal. It's mainly for the kids, so it actually saved us a little bit of money. Um, so, so we had... Like I said, quite a few people there, 22, 23 people, and uh, Logan had a blast, so that's all that matters. I want to say we got there a quarter to 12, and we left, finally left about 4 p.m., so, um, and we were in the room for an hour and a half. So we got to eat and do games, open presents, and hand out all the uh, game cards, so they had a blast. Um, other than that, we came home, and everybody had eaten so much, we just came home and collapsed in the living room and I took a nap for like a half hour so uh, not much going on like I said uh, I'm gonna finish this little bit of talking right here and um, I think I've mentioned before that I'm in a car club uh, it's called relaxed atmosphere and uh, my chapter here in California uh, we're the ones who started the club uh, 25 years ago and it's grown worldwide now we have uh, it's all across the US we have a chapter in uh, Canada, we've got a chapter in Japan. So in May, my chapter, we had our car sh uh, our show, our car show that we do. A um, couple weeks ago, or two, three weeks ago in June, um, the Oregon chapter had their show. Uh, last weekend, the Japan chapter had their first show. And then in September, the Tennessee chapter will have their show. So we, uh, oh, and then... Oh, they're scraping the coast. I can't remember when that was, but that's in Louisiana, and that's loosely a relax show. Uh, it's a member that puts it on, but I, I don't know if the club runs it or not. But anyway, we have four or five car shows throughout the country, actually throughout the world now, now that Japan's doing it. And uh, one of our guys that used to be out here in California is in Japan, because um, he's in the Navy. So uh, he helped them with the show, and he took pictures for me. So he just uploaded all those to me, so I'll finish here, I'm going to go upstairs, I'm going to edit pictures that he sent me, put them on truckrun.net, and then I have to finish editing last night's vlog, get that posted, and then see how late it is, and I might get a little bit done for today's vlog, um, but I, try, I, I don't worry about those until you know Tuesday or Wednesday. So um, didn't get any woodworking done this weekend, which, well I got a little bit yesterday, but nothing of any consequence. And uh, I'm going to a big car show in Bakersfield next weekend that's a three-day show. So I'm actually going to get there Friday afternoon. Um, there's a DJ going Friday night. So we go, go out and dance and drink and do all the stuff. Um, Saturday is a car show. And then uh, Saturday um, night we do more dancing and partying. And um, it's, it's a camping type of thing. So I usually drink till 4 in the morning, stumble over to my tent and go to sleep. Uh, Sunday they do trophies and then everybody drives home. So I'll definitely be doing a lot of video uh, over the weekend for that. Um, so you have something to look forward to, you know, next weekend. And then the weekend after that, I gotta get a woodworking project done because I'm definitely gonna be behind. But that's pretty much been my crazy life the last couple of months. So hopefully we'll get back on track with the woodworking. Other than that, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.